My name is Aaron Ralston. I come from Colorado. I gallivant these craggy lands like a reckless desperado. I'd given up the normal things, security, career, to be a desert wanderer and a solo mountaineer. I've purposefully courted death. It was part of my plan. The goal is not the mountain peak, but to improve the man. Pursuing thrills and challenges after many a brush with death. Yes, there have been many times I thought I might be taking my last breath. I've lived through storms and avalanches, oftentimes alone. I'd enjoyed the luck of an Irishman, no major broken bones. And when the crises passed away, I went back to what I do. I've learned many and many lessons, but perhaps I've missed a few. In April of 2003, I was canyoning alone in Blue John Canyon, Utah, a slot canyon of sandstone. Nobody else knew where I was, just somewhere in Utah. My self-reliant arrogance, almost a fatal flaw. I was descending casually, then to my shock and alarm. I knocked a giant chalk stone loose and it pinned my right arm. The rocket weighed 800 pounds, it was wedged against the wall. My right hand smashed between the two, my chances they looked small. I had but a pint of water left and very little food. A couple of burritos and my own fortitude. The boulder wouldn't budge an inch, though I tried and tried and tried. If only I'd been Sisyphus and could roll it up the side. I knew I had but days to live if I could not get free. Hypothermia was possible, but my chief enemies were thirst and dehydration, they would probably do me in. I'd fight my fate up to my death, but where could I begin? I tried to chip the rock away with my cheap multi-tool. It only made the knife blade dull, which later would prove cruel. I finally realized my last chance was to amputate my arm. But my knife could never cut the bone, I realized with alarm. On the fifth day I had no food, likewise my water gone. I knew that I would perish soon, but my will to live was strong. Desperate I decided to drink my own liquid waste. I did manage to gag it down, but it was a bitter taste. I knew I must cut off my arm, no other choice was left. Desperation has a cruel logic. When you're faced with death I knew that I might bleed to death In fact, the odds were high I carved my own epitaph On the rock wall standing nigh I fashioned a rough tourniquet Webbing and carabiners Conditions were quite primitive In my surgical arena I cut away the flesh and tendons, it was painful work. I snapped my radius and ulna, just using strength and torque. I was borderline delirious, but there arose in me a violent exultation, for I was finally free. I crawled out of the canyon, goodbye my would-be tone, propelling down a long sheer cliff. I began my long trek home.